the, just the amount of impact that the Sony breach had, um, it really opened a lot of eyes that, wow, corporations are open to attack. Um, hackers are getting a lot more creative. They're getting inside uh, companies in ways that uh, we haven't seen before. Um, it's really easy to destroy the, the IP of a company nowadays, it seems. And I, I think that Sony breach was uh, pretty, pretty substantial. So I'm pretty sure the, um, the U.S. Department of Defense, the uh, the one's been in the news quite recently in terms of um, all of the uh, classified uh, personnel or personnel with access to classified information, all of their information leaking out. And and that's a really good example where there were the right kind of uh, technologies in place. They had a whole pile of controls, but simply because a few critical items were left off the, off the list, they were compliant but not necessarily complete from a security perspective. Today, it's really just uh, the adoption of standards, uh, really. It's how do we make it simple to adopt these technologies. There's a lot of sophistication in the key management products that are out there today, especially from like HP. We make life a lot easier in terms of management, but standards are really that glue that enable us to apply key management to the various types of applications that customers are using. So for example, storage environments, Internet of Things, uh, different applications, uh, cloud security, for example, is important, but customers want an easy way to adopt these technologies, and through standards, we're able to simplify the way that we connect key management solutions like what HP provide with the types of applications that the customers are using today in the storage and application space and so forth. Our biggest hurdle is helping customers understand that um, using our technology to adopt KMIP doesn't necessarily mean that we are removing the, the chance to be innovative or to demonstrate their key competencies. It's mainly about taking away uh, the pain of integrating to a standard for the transaction of management keys whilst allowing them the freedom to put their value add over the top of that and not have to get bogged down in the boring stuff. Um, so key management, whilst it isn't uh, particularly uh, you know, sexy technology, it is absolutely critical. So the hurdle is getting customers to understand that we're not in the, in the business of getting in the way of their, uh, their innovations and, and, and really the value add that they deliver their customers, merely just to take the pain away from conforming with the specifications.